Hello everyone, I am Olai and I'll be showing you briefly how to trade on Binance and buy cryptocurrencies through the P2P method. Now the first thing you will need to do is to launch your Binance mobile app. Now I've opened mine already, so I'll just click directly from the home page there. I'm going to click on more. You can see deposit, referral, launch pad and so on and then you can see more click on this more now this is what i have on the more you drag it down and go to the trade under the trades you will see the p2p so you click on the p2p now automatically it will take you directly to the p2p section where to show you the different kinds of coins that you can buy that is available for trade on the p2p method now you can see BT, USDT, BTC, BUSD, BNB, Ethereum, Naira and then the last coin there. So I want to buy B, um, USDT worth 50,000 Naira. So I'll go back to USDT. And then at the top right hand here, I can see NGN which is for Naira, symbol for Naira. Under it a little I can see um, funnel, something like a funnel. So I'm going to click on the funnel to filter. They buy orders so i'm clicking on bank transfer because that is how i'm going to make payment to the person then i'm going to enter the fifty thousand naira because that's what i want to buy and then return back and click yes so now it has filtered the trade for me which means every single individual that i'm having on this buy order are willing to sell up to fifty thousand and even more now when you are trading on binance p2p you must be very careful and you must pay attention to this never trade with someone with low trading um volume with that is with a with a low quantity of trades for instance this first person here has traded um 124 times that is at the right hand side you can see 124 trades now the second person a sonic exchange he has traded 83 times so i can't trade with such people now go to the third one you are saying diam diam the um, investment he has traded 1500 tra times but i don't want to trade with such a person i'm looking for someone with over 2000 trades so i'll keep going until i find very good you can see this as well now this one is saying his name is Reed Thames. That's his username here, and then he has traded about five thousand three hundred and fifty-three times. So this is the person I'm willing to buy from. So I'm going to click on buy. After clicking on buy, I'm going to type the amount, which is fifty thousand naira, and then I'll click buy with zero fee. After clicking buy with zero fee to show this to me, and then. On that year, I'm seeing cancel and to payment page. So I'm going to click on to payment page. Click on that there. Now, the only thing you're going to do on this side is to copy the person's account number and then go ahead to make payment into this person's account number. Please, when making payments on Binance P2P, don't write Binance on the description or on the narration as the case may be from your bank from your banking app and avoid making payment through usd code always make payment through the banking app and when making payment avoid using words like binance p2p usdt or and don't even put anything relating with crypt relating to cryptocurrencies just type paid if you don't know what to type just type your name on it that is all to avoid um, federal government issues in nigeria currently so now after making the payment you must return back to binance and click on transferred notify seller if you look down here you'll be saying help you'll be saying transferred notify seller you click on transferred notify seller after clicking on that the person will confirm that he has received the money and then release the usdt to you immediately thank you for watching if you've not subscribed do well to subscribe and drop your comments if you have any question you can ask through the comment section as well